And taking a live look outside, overcast, a little bit cloudy, but it is warm out there. So hopefully they will not need to crank up the heat this week because it's going to be unusually warm. Let's get to meteorologist Allison Pryor. Hi, Allison. And that's right, Latrice, that energy assistance, instead of it being for turning on the heat, it might be for turning on the air conditioner for this week. As we look at our high temperatures, just continuing to stair step up, especially over the next four days. So 67 for your high today, which sounds like it's not too too warm, but remember it's still February. Our normal should be 57, so that's 10 degrees above normal. Up to 69 tomorrow, 75 on Wednesday, and then Thursday, forecasted high of 81 degrees. That is the record high temperature for February 23rd, which is Thursday, but also for the month of February. So we're certainly going to be on record watch uh, to see if we maybe tie that or potentially even break that and setting a new record. It resets a bit on Friday, but even then that 60 is above normal, and then we step back up once again. So the entire week week above normal high temperatures. What about rain chances? Well, we will also have daily rain chances for the week ahead too, but notice you're not seeing any kind of per high percentages on there. 80%, 90%, 100%. It's just a few scattered showers here and there for each day, so not large amounts of rainfall, but might be something that you could get caught in a light rain shower at some point for this week. As we look at individually today, just for the next few hours, we'll have a couple of spotty showers, mainly affecting our northern communities, but there even have been a few sprinkles here in Chattanooga. Really, we'll see those rain chances going up and why we have the 30% on there for today for what comes through tonight. Even then, it will be hit or miss scattered activity with a broken line of showers dropping across our area. So here's the rainfall that's happening right now. Again, those are those few sprinkles that I was talking about in Chattanooga. You can also see that up towards the north, Bledsoe County, Ray County, and over into Monroe County. Let's pull back a little bit further, and you'll notice that most of the bulk of the rain it's really in northeast Tennessee going up into Kentucky as well. So we're just in that southern extent right now, but we do have those clouds draped across the area. As we continue to look ahead to about 245 this afternoon, still dealing with that southern extent of those little bit of showers. Again, the further to the south you are in Georgia, you're getting more breaks in the clouds, but for everybody, that wind coming up from the south, so with mostly cloudy to cloudy skies, still fueling that warm up to the 60s. Here comes that broken line of scattered showers that I mentioned for tonight. So after sunsets, having that drop in across our area, Area. We're generally moving from the northwest to the southeast into early on Tuesday morning, and then that pushes out of here. For your Tuesday, I do think we'll have more breaks in the clouds. So a mix of sun and clouds, we'll call it partly sunny overall. Again, a few additional scattered showers possible, especially for our southern communities on Tuesday. Wednesday, look at all those red lines. That south wind really kicks in. That's why we're having those high temperatures in the 70s on Wednesday. Clouds clearing up, that mix of sun and clouds again, really allowing for a nice day smack dab in the middle of the week. Now, remember, we did have those daily rain chances, but none of them were high percentages, so certainly no washouts. This is future cast rainfall through the end of the work and school week, Friday night at 11.59 p.m., not a whole lot on the board here, about a quarter of an inch to a half inch on average. We're talking about the totals for the entire week ahead. So today, just a couple spotty daytime showers that scattered activity tonight. Here are your high temperatures in the low to mid 60s. Chattanooga, Dalton, Fort Payne all topping out at 67. Those scattered showers tonight, mostly cloudy, mild lows for this time of year in the low to mid 50s. And again, that warm as is going to continue. So quiet weather overall for President's Day. Tomorrow for Mardi Gras, 69 degrees, but Thursday, the big warm day with a high of 81. Wow, those are some warm temperatures for this time of year. Thank you, Allison.